computers seem sophisticated, but they really aren't. There's a case, and then there's stuff inside the case. There's a motherboard, then there's stuff that goes in the motherboard. Like the processor, and a big heatsink that goes over top the processor and spins to keep the processor cool really super fast, like a dog chasing its tail, but really super fast. Next, if the computer doesn't rely on a shitty integrated video card, the graphics video card goes in the motherboard. And after that, some RAM gets stuck in the RAM sockets. There should also be a power supply to provide everything with power. In the average computer, you'll find a hard drive or two nested in some 3.5 inch bays along the walls of the computer. They do some stuff for the computer too. CD and DVD drives go into bays on the side of the computer. Finally, once you get everything in the computer and you get all the cables hooked up and all that fun stuff, then the power cable gets plugged into the wall. And then there's a power button on the front of the computer that starts the computer sometimes. Yay, you got a blue screen. You build a computer that doesn't work. You got a software issue.